Okay, so at the time I'm recording this video, about 10 minutes ago, official planning permission was leaked from Indiana Beach. They are planning to add two new rides to the park in 2021. The first one is a family flat ride, which is nothing special, but the second one is a steel triple loop roller coaster. So I'm going to be discussing that triple loop roller coaster in today's video. But before I get started, I just want to say that all of this news is, well, new, and some of it may change in the future. And also, also, sorry if this video isn't the best because this is very fresh information and I just wanted to get this video out as quick as possible. So let's just run over a few basics. A triple loop roller coaster, aka meaning a roller coaster that will go upside down three times. Let's think about a few coasters that Indiana Beach may add that have three inversions. No offense to the park, but they clearly don't have the budget for a B&M, Mach, or an Intamin. So that leaves Gerslauer, but that's highly unlikely. So what is one roller coaster that may be up for sale that does have three inversions, Humera. This was a Schwarzkopf looping coaster that operated at La Feria Chapultepec Magico until its unfortunate derailment at the end of 2019. This is what I, as well as many other coaster enthusiasts, are speculating that may come to Indiana Beach for next year, and this would be a massive investment for the park, and it will surely be a great fit at the park as well. And I know what many of you guys might be thinking, why would they want a roller coaster that has killed two people? And here's the thing, Mexico doesn't have as many safety regulations as the US, so when it does get imported from Mexico, it will be equipped with all new safety procedures, and obviously will get new trains, as well as probably some improvements to the ride and overall structure. As of the time I'm recording this video, we do not know a name, color scheme, theme, or even where the coaster will be located, but we just know that this is going to be a slam dunk addition for Indiana Beach. I honestly feel like this could be the best coaster in the park, and it will surely be the most intense. So that's going to wrap up this video. What do you think of the new triple loop roller coaster coming to Indiana Beach in 2021? Let me know in the comments down below, and be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch you guys next time on Hang Time Thrills.